This was an incident that quickly turned tragic. A man who tried to stop his girlfriend from driving drunk ended up falling to his death. But the woman's lawyer says this is not a murder case. Bob Allen explains. In court today, Jessica Royal answered to the charges of homicide and homicide by vehicle for the death of her boyfriend, Ryan Minette. In March, Royal and Minette were in a domestic dispute that led to her leaving in her SUV. Manette tried to stop her by grabbing onto the luggage rack of the vehicle. Police say she was driving under the influence and drove through a Cranberry neighborhood for a half mile with Manette hanging on. Witnesses told police Royal was speeding through this neighborhood, running through stop signs, with Manette holding on to the luggage rack screaming, you're going to kill me. A detective even testified that Manette never had a chance to jump off the vehicle without getting hurt. Eventually, Manette fell off the vehicle, tumbling 45 feet, hitting a concrete barrier and a light post. He died the next day at UPMC Presbyterian. Royal's attorney believes this is not a homicide case. She had no intention of killing him. Uh, I mean, the last thing this case is is a murder case, and being charged with homicide is troubling. But Attorney Diffenderfer believes a call she made to 911 will verify that she was in fear for her life trying to get away. She only knew him for two months, but she certainly knew about his past, and his past is, is definitely, um, you know, riddled with uh, PFA, things like that. So, um, yeah, she was fearful. But it Still, investigators say Manette could have stopped, but didn't. Monday morning quarterback, it's very easy. She only went a half mile. Bob Allen, KDKA TV News.